Hey guys, Peter here from Specialty. Uh, this two second lean we did a couple of weeks ago, but unfortunately we were not able to take up a four video because the day that we took the other table apart, the camera on the mic had died, but we really wanted to get it done. So uh, the way it was before is we just had one bank of drawers here and then a lot of empty space over here. We had this big label printer sitting on the table, which took up half the table and then paperwork was just kind of scattered everywhere. So what me and my two other uh, lead hands that did is uh, Vitaly and Matthew is we kind of designed this table the way we liked it. So we have a left bank of drawers here just for outsource and the other assorted stuff. We're gonna organize that yet. And on the right side, we have a bank of drawers specifically for myself, Matthew and Vitaly. And then we also moved the printer over here so that everything's uh, right hand reach, same as the scanner, it was over here, but since all of us are right handed, it made more sense to have that over here. We did a little cutout box back here so the garbage labels we could just throw out before the box was down here, so we always had to move back, throw the labels out, it was just constant back and forth. And yeah, that takes care of that two second lean. So for my next two second lean idea is our paper box that we have. I want to redo this paper box in the top kind of clean up the clutter, same as the wall back here, uh, just to kind of organize it a bit. So that'll be my two second lead. Thanks. Hey guys, Peter back at Specialty here. As you can see, our lead hand table is looking a lot spiffier than it did. Uh, so for my addition that I added to this is I added, I made a new paper box. The old one that we had was just garbage. Uh, so for this one, it holds up to eight flow numbers, so we can backtrack our orders if we ever need to go back to see who did what. Um, yeah, then the slot on the bottom is just for overflow. Uh, the old one dropped right to the ground, so this one I just added a four and a half inch toe kick height to match the other two, so you're not kicking the bottom all the time. Uh, also, what I did is I added. A little slot for our broken blades so that the tin itself doesn't have to sit on top of the table now there's a little more space if we want to add something else in the future uh, a little hole on the side will eventually get filled but for now I'm leaving it open I moved a few things around up here one other thing that I did is this cord for the scanner uh, came out of that hole so whenever you wanted to scan something it would always get tangled up and then put it back and then you constantly had to push the cord back. So what I did is I just rerouted it through a more convenient place. So now it's basically just scan, beep up boop, done. And it doesn't it doesn't get tangled up, it doesn't get in the way. So yeah, that's my two second lean. Thanks for watching.